and I'm not sure. Let's let's just start by creating one beam, and then I'll 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 find out why this window is not showing up. So let's create one beam. Boy, this window there there should be a there should be a window which shows the selection. Um, I think some of you. Uh, my guess is that some of you working at a higher resolution should be having no problems, but because of this uh, webinar, it's not the resolution I'm at is pretty low. Um, make sure that when you're working um, in a file that uh, you're working at a proper resolution, um, which should be more than than uh, than what I'm displaying here. Um, Sorry about that. We'll get into we'll get into we we'll get into beams um, starting next session. I promise. Um, we'll also be addressing the uh, uh, walls and and doors and windows. Um, and we'll get into uh, the uh, how we can change and update the model using Excel. So this is uh, this can be a pretty powerful tool for um, for uh, driving the uh, a very large uh, BIM model by just using an Excel table. Um, uh, just real real quick, I want to uh, I want to thank everyone for attending um, the second uh, webinar session uh, from Gary Technologies. Um, I want to just point out that uh, this is just the beginning of navigating the environment. Um, if you need further assistance or you want to dive deeper into a digital project, um, you may want to consider one of our training courses, which if you go to the website here, um, is under support training. Um, you can go, go to the website and submit a training request. Um, there's some some courses outlined here. Um, we also tailor courses. Um, you can you can choose to take uh, sessions, uh, training sessions, here in one of in the LA office or one of the offices worldwide. Or we can also travel to your location for group events. Um, so that said, um, send your questions to knowledge at uh, at Gary to it's knowledge at gtglobal.com um, and again the the wiki if you haven't signed on already the wiki has uh, a plethora a plethora of information um, it also if you sign on has the documentation resources um, one other quick thing uh, will be uh, I don't know if anyone will be attending the Acadia event in Chicago but we'll be there uh, giving a workshop. Um, the workshop will be based in uh, knowledge patterns, um, which is a more high-level uh, scripting uh, tool within Digital Project. Um, and if anyone is curious about how uh, how to use knowledge patterns and how to apply them to um, a design problem. Uh, we'll be giving workshop that's August 19th through the 21st, or sorry, <laughs> October 19th through the 21st um, in Chicago. So, um, just like to to thank you. And next time uh, we'll be wrapping up the the uh, structural modeling, and we'll go into uh, walls and doors and windows, and um, and hopefully we'll get into a little bit of Excel. If not, we'll we'll get we'll touch on that in the next session. Um, so again, thank you for attending, and we'll see you again next week, same time, same place. Thanks. <laughs>